from the Canary Islands. This is the scene here at the Estadio de Gran Canaria. I'm Derek Ray, and adjacent to me in the commentary box is Stuart Robson, and getting ready for a potentially thrilling contest. It's Real Madrid versus Poland. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. And the starting players for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is in goal. Antonio Rudiger plays alongside David Alaba in central defence. Kylian Mbappe starts alongside Paul Pogba in central midfield. And the starting role in attack is handed to Cristiano Ronaldo. A look at the starting lineup for Poland. Well, it looks like they're going to play in a 3 4 3 formation, but without wing backs. So, although they might have an overload in midfield, they will be vulnerable to any switches of play by the opposition. A really exciting game in prospects as Real Madrid get it underway. Di Maria. Mbappe. Ronaldo feeds it. Well, no degree of difficulty for the goalkeeper. Well, considering the form book, Stuart, Kylian Mbappe has got to be taken seriously here. Well, Derek, we know his movement is very clever, but it's the speed of that movement that causes defenders so many problems. He's got great pace, he gets 1v1 against the goalkeepers, and nobody can recover. An early goal! It is the ideal opening! Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection, and he has so much pace on it. It's a great goal. Are back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Rikovia. Lewandowski now. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? A fine reading of the situation. Pogba. Well, they get the ball once more. Out of play, Real Madrid throw here. Holland making sure it didn't get past him and all the way through it goes to the goalkeeper and not a great challenge free kick here Can he finish? Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. Playing it short. 
Zielinski. Now with Lewandowski. And a goal kick given. Pogba. So plenty of forward momentum from Real Madrid here. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Zhurkovsky. Good visualisation and execution. Not to be this time. And nearing the half-time interval, Real Madrid hold the edge here, Stuart. Oh, he's in behind them here, Derek. And a touch of finesse. Oh, how about that for a chip? Savour it. Pure brilliance. Well, we can take another look now. It's wonderful interplay between the two of them to start the move. And what a great finish it is. He just lifts the ball over the keeper into the back of the net. That's a well-constructed goal. So in business once more, on the back of that very important equaliser, 1-1. One, one. Holland. The referee's whistle, half-time here at the Estadio de Gran Canaria. An analysis of Robert Lewandowski's performance up to this point leads us to very positive reviews, you've got to say, Stuart. Well, I think he's been outstanding so far. He's looked a constant threat and he scored a very good goal. What a player he is. So back underway here into the second half. Takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Cristiano Ronaldo. Now Holland. Di Maria. Ronaldo! Well, really, making the goalkeeper's life simple. That should be hit in the back of the net. That was a big, big chance. Can he put them in front? Well, it was a wonderful chance, but the goalkeeper comes through. Yes, Derek, we have to give credit to the keeper, but surely he should have scored there. That's a big, big chance. And the short option preferred. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. And teammates to play it to. Mendy. On to Martinez. Can they nudge in front? Oh, a goal! Well, maybe we shouldn't be surprised. They were asking for trouble with their passive approach. Well, let's look at this again. The one and two touch passing is absolutely outstanding to play around the pressure. And Haaland made the finish look easy, as he so often does. It's a lovely goal. And the ball is moving again. Anyone's guess how this is going to finish? 2-1 currently. Lewandowski has given it straight to the opposition. Martinez. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Will it be sufficiently imaginative? And a chance to level it. In it goes! He's made it a brace for himself. No stopping him, apparently.
Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And Lewandowski does the rest. He hits through the back of the ball with such power. It's a great finish. So underway again, and it's a story of parity. Two goals apiece in this one. Carvajal. Keeping the ball moving, but then the one that goes astray. Holland. On to Ronaldo. No way through. And no nonsense defensive clearance. Lewandowski. And given away by Poland. It's not lost on them what a goal could mean at this late stage. Not the best clearance. Counter attacking, very much an option. Do they have the guile to open up the defence? Well, it peters out, but they still might be able to do something. Jurovsky just cutting off the supply. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. Well, that's a super ball over the top. And there's the referee's whistle. These two sides cannot be separated.